This is the Tacoma Narrows Bridge, a two-lane suspension bridge built in the late 1930s across the Strait of Puget Sound in Washington State. After opening to traffic, the bridge began to shake in an unusual way. Wind passing over the deck caused it to oscillate violently up and down. The slender bridge was not robust enough to take such a battering, and just four months after opening, it collapsed. With the narrow deck, you're working on the edge of aerodynamic stability. Like the Tacoma Narrows crossing, Jamal's bridge is slender, built to carry just two lanes of traffic. But this super skinny design makes the bridge extra susceptible to strong winds. The wind will create some curls, and you can have the bridge oscillating up and down. As the wind gusts over a bridge from one side, it travels above and below the road deck. A change in air pressure forces the wind to curl backwards in the other direction as it clears the opposite edge of the deck. This process is called vortex shedding. These wind curls, or vortices, begin to move the deck up and down. They can cause the bridge to oscillate and twist violently. To prevent this, Jamal is designing the edge of the deck on his bridge to have a special aerodynamic shape. It smooths the flow of wind and reduces the vortices. His design should help this bridge remain steady when hit by the strongest gusts. So one way to, to mitigate that is to limit this angle to below 16 degrees. Then you can avoid any vortex shedding phenomenon. 